Hi guys, uh, my name's Ray Newland and this is a message purely for Director of Cultures throughout the Florida region. Now before I explain why I've been asked to put this uh, video together, uh, just please let me quickly introduce myself and explain who, you know, what, we, what we do. I've already said my name's Ray Newland. Uh, hi, uh, I'm a, a goalkeeping coach. I've been very fortunate to have been a professional goalkeeper for 10 years. Uh, playing for clubs like sort of Everton and a Premiership club, Wigan Athletic. Uh, but in 1999, aged just 28, after 10 years being a pro, uh, I got injured, lost my career. But thankfully, uh, in the same year, 1999, I founded Just for Keepers. Uh, now, Just for Keepers is now the largest and leading goalkeeping schools worldwide. Uh, we're in 19 countries and across, and across five continents. We coach about 5,000 goalkeepers a week uh, and every country that we uh, we operate in, we, we work hand in hand with a lot of grassroots clubs to help the, the coaches, the goalkeeping coaches, but more importantly, the goalkeepers. Uh, now, before I continue to, uh, to talk, I'm not a public speaker, okay? I'm actually just doing this from my laptop, so I don't feel very comfortable um, speaking in front of the uh, the, the camera. Um, I do all my damage on the soccer field, guys. Yep, so if I stutter, anything like that, please don't laugh. <laughs> uh, I'm just gonna try and speak to you coach to coach, and hopefully you'll see what we offer is very, very, very unique in Florida. Well, actually, throughout the US. Now, are we saying that we're better than other goalkeeping coaches, no, we would never be that arrogant. Are we good at what we do? Yes. Are we experienced? Yes. There's over a million hours combined uh, professional playing experience between all the coaches throughout J4K, throughout the world. Uh, so we, we've got we've got coaches who've played in, internationally. Well, a lot of coaches played internationally, professionally. So we've definitely got the experience, guys. But I think what's very unique about J4K compared to what other coaching schools do with the greatest respect because they might not have the experience, which I'll explain that in a sec, uh, why I keep saying the word experience, sorry, or they might not have the contacts. Now, normally what happens with other goalkeeping uh, coaching is the a goalkeeper age 8, 9 or 10 will get to that goalkeeper, uh, the goalkeeper coach, sorry, go through their programme at 18, with the greatest respect, because the coach has not got the experience or the contacts, the goalkeeper goes into the wilderness because that coach cannot obviously move that goalkeeper forward in, in his or her career. What J4K uh, do, uh, has done, which I am very, very proud of, um, is we've got what's called exit strategies for our students. It's something I've worked incredibly hard for and I'll continue to work hard to make sure that we've got, um, I forgot the word, make sure that we've got It'll come to me, guys. I told you I was a thick goalkeeping coach. Opportunities, big word. We've got opportunities for our, our students. So students who come to J4K when they're eight or nine, they come, even if they come to when they come 14 or 15, they'll come through our program. We, we've helped them become professional, semi-professional. Because we're big on education as well, uh, you know, we could get them to scholarships throughout the US, the US, actually worldwide. Uh, and we also help them go into coaching, i.e. goalkeeping coaching. So. Goalkeepers that come to ourselves come right through our program and end up actually getting paid for something that they love. Whatever level that is, that's down to their abilities, you know, on the pitch and, and up here, because we're also into the mental side of goalkeeping, which I won't bore you to death with guys, okay? Because I want this to be a short video. Um, but basically, as I say, you know, I'm very, very proud that we've got exit strategies in place. In fact, no goalkeeping schools in history has achieved what J4K has. For, for goalkeeping students around the world, and that's something I'm deeply, deeply proud uh, about. Now, the reason why I have been asked to put this video together, uh, I'm relocating to Florida, and my partners in Florida uh, have asked me to roll my program out uh, throughout two goalkeeping uh, clubs throughout uh, Florida. In fact, that's how I ended up coming to Florida, uh, because the soccer club wanted all their goalkeeping side of things restructured now that's something that i do all around the world done it for professional football clubs um, and uh, that's what he wanted me to do now even though that they had a goalkeeping coach because this is important to note guys we're not here to steal the goalkeeping coaches thunder uh, you know we're there to help as well now hopefully like most goalkeeping coaches uh, we're very humble guys and hopefully your goalkeeping go coach is a humble guy um, and as I say, I've, I've, I've been lucky enough, I've rubbed shoulders as a professional 
and doing J4K for the past 13 years and coaching internationally with some of the, the, the highest level, sorry, the highest level goalkeeping coaches you can come across. I'm talking international coaches in the Premiership, highest level. Even those guys, they still ask for advice. You know, also think about this, your, your coaches, uh, your first team coach, they ask for advice. They've got an assistant. They might bring in a striker coach from time to time, a defending coach from time to time, a free kick specialist from time to time, a sports psychologist from time to time. So if your first team coach needs a bit of guidance, well, so does your goalkeeping coach, guys. Yeah. Now, even though he might not admit it, you know what was it? Uh, you know, uh, bringing in fresh ideas and fresh strategies can only help. So I say, I want to stress that we're not here to steal the, the coaches thunder. We're there to, to help the goalkeeping coach, also the coaches, and more importantly, the ones who benefit as the goalkeepers. Now, before I explain about our program, I'm not too sure if you realise this, but did you realise most more soccer clubs lose goalkeepers than any other position on the field? And now, even though these ten positions on the field and only one goalkeeper, what you know, why is that? Statistically, that shouldn't happen. The reason why that happens, guys, is because you're not most clubs. Sorry, not yourself. I don't because I don't know you personally. From my experience, most goalkeeper, most soccer clubs don't keep the goalkeepers happy. Even though they might have a fantastic program, those goalkeepers are very hard to please, guys. We only need something small to upset us. And what it is is because we, because we feel the odd man out. Now, even though we're part, obviously they're in a team, I can tell you this now, from coaching indirectly and directly. 50,000 goalkeepers over the past X amount of years, being a professional goalkeeper, goalkeepers only need that much of a reason and not an excuse, and they don't feel part of the team. Honestly, guys, okay, you've got to believe me on that one. Okay, even though they are part of the team, we do feel like the odd man out now, so you've got to make sure that they're getting the, the, the development that they need. Now, I know you've got to be careful because you've got other players to, you know, you just can't dote on your goalkeepers. And that's where we come in with the, this course that we've got, which is very, very unique. Um, but also as well, uh, if you've not got the right developments in place or the right experienced goalkeeping coach, and I'll come back to why I said experienced, I will tell you this now, you will lose the best goalkeepers in your area to a competitive soccer club if they've got the experienced goalkeeper, uh, goalkeeping coach. Now, put yourself in the shoes of a goalkeeper and the parents, okay? Especially now they're getting educated because they now realise, you know, outfield players, they're getting faster, stronger, quicker. The balls are now designed to move a lot faster. So they know they've got to be one step ahead. So they want the best coaching possible. Um, and put yourself, as I say, put yourself in the, sh in, in the shoes of a parent or a goalkeeper. If you can be at a club, and get expert if you're at a club sorry and your goalkeeper coach uh, might have the qualifications but not really had the experience as playing himself at a high level or the, more importantly the contacts to help and the goalkeeper and you've got a sorry and there's a choice to go to another club where the goalkeeper is an ex-pro got contacts all over the world um, so you can take that goalkeeper and maybe help that goalkeeper have a career be honest with yourself who would you go to yep i'm not i'm not saying please don't think i'm knocking your goalkeeper if if they've not got that experience and contact i promise you i'm not because anyone who's willing to take time off their lives to develop a child whether it's a goalkeeper or outfielder has got my hundred percent um i forgot my words again here guys you know um I'm 100% proud of what they do, so to speak, you know, but we're 100% backing because I think anyone who's going to want to help a child is a, is a good guy in my book. So please don't think we're trying to knock your goalkeeping coach. Um, but the fact of the matter is, mums and dads and goalkeepers now are now getting educated. Gone are the days where you can just stick a goalkeeper in goal, kick a few balls at them, do a few drills from memory, from books. Um, and the goalkeeper be happy. It doesn't work now. Uh, and if you don't believe me, okay, it's, it's not my problem with the greatest respect. You'll you'll find out with when you when your goalkeepers go potentially go somewhere else. Um, but as I say, you know what we do. Uh, you know what I'm willing to do when I relocate to to Florida is come in and work with the the, the, the club, the goalkeeper, and also the goalkeepers. It's a six eight or ten week program. I'll come once a week, twice a week, depending on your needs. And what we do is we just look and we restructure uh, the, the, the goalkeeping uh, coaching side of things where it's needed. Also, don't forget, you know, as I say, it's like I'll be learning from your goalkeeping coach, so please don't think I'm going to be coming in 
and telling the goalkeeping coach what to do. You know, at the end of the day, I'm only going to advise him. It's up to him to listen. Um, but as I say, we, you know, I'll, I'll, I'll advise where it needs to be restructured. Look at the drills. More importantly, you know, get the the, the, the goalkeepers working in unison with the, the team. And um, also within the course, uh, I'll, I'm the only goalkeeping coach worldwide that does this. By the way, within the course, I run a, a free goalkeeper awareness course for your coaches because your goalkeeping coach can't be at every game, can't be at every training session, and that's when goalkeepers get cheesed off. Okay, going back to what I said before, that's when they think they feel that the forgotten man or woman, and that's when they leave. So this course is all designed to make your coaches aware, uh, you know, how to, and how to more importantly keep your goalkeepers happy when your goalkeeping coach is not there. As I say, I'm the only one that does this, as far as I'm aware anyway, in the world. Normally I, char I charge about $200 per, uh, per coach for this worldwide, so these 10, it's obviously $2,000, so it's an expensive course. But within this course, because I'm obviously keen, I'm, I'm, I'm relocating to Florida, um, I'm looking to make more uh, more friends within the coaching uh, scenes. I'll be honest with you, this is the only reason why I'm doing it. Uh, you know, so uh, so within this uh, course, it's going to be free. Okay, so I'll do your goalkeeping course, but within the goal within this course, if this makes sense, I'll run a goalkeeper awareness course for your coaches, which will help big time, seriously, guys. And it's fun as well. It's fun. As I believe everything you should do, even though it's very serious, guys. Don't forget, we're, we're coaching children. Uh, it's got to, it's got, it's got to be done in, in, in a fun way, you know. So, so uh, it's everything tongue in cheek, but it's exceptionally, exceptionally. Uh, what, what, what we do is serious. Hopefully, that makes sense. Uh, but as I say, if you're interested, uh, whatever, if you just keep reading below, and I think you've got to send an email off. Um, I'm, because of my time limits, I could probably only help one or two clubs, guys. I'm start. I'm going to be starting in July, so it's only going to be a couple of places available for the whole of Florida. Now, uh, I hope this doesn't come across as arrogance, because if you get to meet me, you'll realise that that's the last thing I am. I, I, dis, I despise arrogant people. I believe you know you should treat people the way you like to be treated yourself. So I hope this doesn't come across arrogant, but. If you email, if you're interested, I'm going to just I'm just going to have a look to see which clubs that I would like to work with. Because uh, if you see any type of arrogance, etc., guys, I, I don't want to, I don't want to go near any club that's arrogant. Uh, because I, uh, if I see any arrogance towards children, as much as I'm a good guy, guys, I'm, and I'm a humble guy, I'd have to say something, and it only ends up in arguments. Because I believe you've got to look after the children like gold dust, to be honest with you. So I'm going to be looking at each club that obviously is interested in, in, in me coming in. Uh, and then what I'll do is I'll think, okay, these guys, wow, these guys, they've got the right mission statements to help their students. I'll happily come in then, guys, and give you a million percent of my time. Last but not least as well, what I'll do as well is your goalkeeping coach. Uh, as soon as it's all finished... Uh, he'll have a lifetime support of myself for free. He'll have my personal email address, not a secretary's, my personal email address. And if you ever get stuck or needs any help, emails me any time. If he wants to come to any of my sessions and watch what I do, he can come there free of charge as my friend without sounding sloppy. Okay, because to me, J4K, the great thing about it, as well as helping the goalkeepers, is the friends that I've made over the years, all over the world, so many coaches, all helping each other. And like, to me, you know, you just don't get a better, better way to make, make a living and make a life uh, by helping others. So uh, if you're interested, please keep reading below, guys. And I look forward to potentially meeting you one day uh, and uh, helping your goalkeepers. Best of goalkeeping.